let me talk to you about one more thing. Several years ago, we started building the Titan, pushing the GPU to the absolute limit to create the best graphics card of that generation. It was built in limited quantities only through NVIDIA. The distribution was limited. The demand surprised us. Creatives were making 4K movies, rendering cinematics. Researchers built workstations for data science and AI. Bloggers built broadcast workstations. Flight and racing simulation fans built sim rigs. There is clearly a need for a giant GPU that is available all over the world. So we made a giant Ampere. Ladies and gentlemen, the RTX 3090. Come here. Come here, Papa. All righty. 3090 is a beast, a ferocious GPU, a BF GPU, 36 shader teraflops, 69 RT teraflops, 285 tensor teraflops, and it comes with a massive 24 gigabytes of G6X. It comes with a silencer, a three slot dual axle flow through design, 10 times quieter and keeps the GPU 30 degrees cooler than the Titan RTX design. But there's more. The 3090 is so big that for the very first time, we can play games at 60 frames per second in 8K. This is insane. Because it's impossible for us to show you what it looks like on the stream, we invited some friends to check it out. Roll the clip. I've never been more excited to do anything. Oh! Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh. Oh my god. No way. This is f***ing incredible, dude. This is amazing. Holy. The resolution on this is silly. My god. You can see wear and tear on the treads. Look at this. Why is it so detailed? All right, all right, all right, all right. Move fast and shoot things. This is 8K, sir. I can see everything. Oh, I need to shoot you, though. Not a whole lot of people have seen something like this. This is so realistic. I feel like I'm really in battle. This is insane. Die, I want to look at the pretty things. There we go. Dude, the ray tracing is insane on this. These are the sizzle reels that you see. This is basically hacks. And then it's like, it'll never look like that. But it does. <laughs> I'm like looking across the vistas, the grand vistas that are happening right now. Holy sh! Look at this. This feels like a Disneyland experience. Oh, it is so smooth. It's butter. Oh, it's smoothish, dude. I can't believe it's not butter. I mean, this is game changing. There's no other way to put it. My mind is blown, dude. Wow. It's been 20 years since the NVIDIA GPU introduced programmable shading. The GPU revolutionized modern computer graphics. Developers jumped on and invented clever algorithms, like shaders that simulate realistic materials, or post-processing effects for soft shadows, ambient occlusion, and reflections. Developers pushed the limits of rasterization beyond anyone's expectations. Meanwhile, NVIDIA GPU processing increased a stunning 100,000-fold. Gaming became a powerful technology driver Gamers grew to billions, and gaming pushed into all aspects of entertainment and culture. If the last 20 years was amazing, the next 20 will seem nothing short of science fiction. Today's Ampere launch is a giant step into the future. This is our greatest generational leap ever. The second generation NVIDIA RTX, fusing programmable shading, ray tracing, and artificial intelligence gives us photorealistic graphics and the highest frame rates at the same time. Once the holy grail of computer graphics, ray tracing is now the standard. And Ampere is going to bring you joy beyond gaming. NVIDIA Reflex to improve your response time. NVIDIA Broadcast turns any room into a studio. And Omniverse Machinima turns you into an animated filmmaker. We are super pleased with 3070, 3080, and 3090, the first three members of the Ampere generation you're gonna feel a boost like never before. I can't wait to go forward 20 years to see what RTX started. Homes will have holodecks. We will beam ourselves through time and space, traveling at the speed of light, sending photons, not atoms. In this future, GeForce is your holodeck, your lightspeed starship, 
your time machine. In this future, we will look back and realize that it started here. Thank you for joining us today and to all of our fans for celebrating the arrival of Ampere.